What's going on guys? We are back tonight with another video for you and sorry it's been a few days. I ended up getting sick. Uh, kind of just felt like a common cold type thing and uh, probably from the circus we went to that <laughs> the week before or whatever but yeah I ended up taking Thursday and Friday off of work. I just wasn't feeling the greatest so uh, I didn't want to do a video with my uh, voice kind of messed up and me sneezing and stuff so figured I wouldn't put you guys through that. But uh, we're back today. We're feeling a little bit better, so might as well go ahead and do a video. And I got a couple cards I wanted to show off here. It's kind of a weird deck. It doesn't feel like it, it should go together, but it actually plays decent, surprisingly. Uh, I wanted to show off Earthrise, one of the new Ultra Fusion cards here. Uh, when played, if your deck contains exactly seven science cards, your space cards, wherever they are, gain 18 until played. Now, it's kind of weird in this deck because I only have four space cards. I'm doing the Planet X, but I have exactly four because I'm comboing Tractor Beam. So, weird combo, but again, it it's, feels decent. Uh, tractor Beam, when played, if your deck contains exactly four space cards, your Futurology cards, wherever they are, gain 18 until played. So... Uh, one, one wants us to rock seven science cards, which we're going to make futurology cards and one wants four space cards. So, uh, kind of did the little combo there off those two. <clears throat> so let's take a look at the rest of the space cards here. We, we went with planet X obviously, because we get the additional, uh, 14 until played with, uh, four space cards. And then you get the 14 permanent, uh, super massive black hole on return for every non space card in your deck. Give your space cards plus three until played. So they're going to get that 42 until played. And then Cartwheel Galaxy. Great card for uh, the come from behind victories. This deck probably will lose a little early. But uh, rounds four and five, we try to cycle Cartwheel. So we can get them both those rounds and then hopefully win on the back of it. <clears throat> uh, let's see. We've got uh, some of the... Let's go through the Futurology cards. We're rocking Flying Car. Dude, where's my car, dude? Have you seen my car, bro? I used to love that movie back in the day. What's mine say? Dude, no, what's mine say? Sweet. <laughs> For those of you that remember that movie. But anyway, it says, when played, if you have played Flying Car this game, your Futurology cards in hand gain 30 for two turns. So a little buff to Futurology. Another Futurology cloaking device. When played, three random cards in your hand gain 35 this turn, but reveal after scoring. Memory Eraser. When returned, your Futurology cards, wherever they are, gain 20 until played. For every time you have played Memory Eraser this game, your Futurology cards lose 10 until played. So, interesting mechanic there on that card. <clears throat> Electro Laser. When drawn, gain uh, 2 energy, and your opponent's cards in hand lose 10 this turn. A uh, laser vision when returned, a random science card in your hand gains 30 and costs minus two perm. And doomsday clock when played, if it's turn three and you're losing the round, this card gains 85 on the turn. So that's our futurology, our seven cards there that we chose. Now, what else? We had <clears throat> mana machine also buffing futurology cards. You can see. Uh, if you have played three or more philosophy cards this game, your Futurology cards are going to get 24 until played. So because we're playing philosophy cards, we wanted to toss in Fatalism. It's a great card for philosophy. Two random philosophy cards in your hand gain 50 perm. So getting into the late game, they get bigger and bigger. Also I've got the new Animism here. When drawn, your other cards in hand get 32 and cost plus two until played. And then a random card in, in your opponent's hand gets 32 and cost plus two until played. And then finally, we got Rene Descartes. When drawn, your cards in hand gain four perm. This card, 12 perm. And then the rest of the deck primarily is energy. We want El Dorado. Get that plus four for three turns. Iron Maiden also going to carry us into the late game for energy. And then we've got, you guys know I've been high on this card just because I love the permanent power you get, William. Sebold so here, if, if this is the only espionage card in your deck, your opponent's cards in hand gain 15 this turn, and your cards in hand gain 15 perm. <clears throat> I could see swapping this out for like Andronicus to get that nice uh, kind of buff on a turn, but uh, I don't know. I still like William here. Carries me into the late game. 
But all right, let's go check it out. I'm just going to play one tonight. My wife is making us a nice steak dinner in there, and I'm excited. She said it's about done, so I need to hustle this bad boy up. So <clears throat> try to get some more videos out for you later in the week. Maybe do two games in those. But tonight, that and this deck's kind of weird anyway. I don't, I don't see you guys, you know, rushing out to build this deck. But, you know, we, we want to try weird stuff sometimes and see what happens, you know. Like I said, I think this is an odd combo, but it surprisingly felt decent when I played it. So that's what we're going with. <clears throat> Hopefully we don't just get steamrolled tonight. There's always that possibility. All right, let's see here. I'm just going to play two. Opponent's already going for that energy there. If I hold on to some philosophy cards too, it might help my fatalism out. Oh, let's see. Porsche cloaking device hits itself and it's in front of the gun, so unfortunate there. <clears throat> Alright, we got our doomsday clock. Looks like it's online. So let's go ahead and drop it down. Hmm. Laser vision, kind of useless. We don't get the ability here. But I think we play it because we're probably going to draw Fatalism and I want to get the buff on Mana Machine. If you guys are curious on that choice. All right, we're hurting. He's got a pretty nasty deck, so it's going to be a tough one for us. But, you know, if we can keep up with a deck like this, could be good for us. I, I really want to draw a cartwheel right now, though. Nope, no cartwheel. All right, let's see, I need to get Eldorado going for sure. Let's do Tractor Beam. Ooh, that's it, huh? That's all my energy. Hmm. All right, we'll do it like that then. Really wanted to get three cards down there. That's unfortunate. Like I said, this deck, late game's fine with energy. It's just the early turns, which is fine because the deck wants to lose early game anyway. Oh, uh, we didn't draw our cartwheel there. That's unfortunate for cycling purposes. Yeah, unfortunate draw there. So we're probably in trouble now. That, that kills my round four or five play. Fatalism too, it took forever. What is this? Like the cards we need coming right at the very end. Shinny. Yeah, it's going to be a tough one. As expected. Black dog. <clears throat> Hit our black hole there. Let's get Black Hole down. All right. Oh, he's got Heimdall too, huh? Well, 
This might be GG's. You guys, we might not even win a round here. <laughs> Definitely possible. Sucks, I actually played a tiny deck right before this video and kicked its butt, so... It was a pretty pretty meta tiny deck, too, so I was kind of surprised I was able to, to beat it, but... Looks like we, I don't know, this one's definitely giving us a little more run for our money here. A little bit heavier of a hitter. Right, down 140, yeah, it's probably game. Did get our doomsday, though. Just not enough. Yep, I think that's game. All right, guys. Well, hopefully you enjoyed the deck. Like I said, it was it was a weird one tonight, but I wanted to try it out. I had been winning with it, too, but surprisingly. But not, not against a deck like this. This is all-out meta deck here, so sometimes it happens that way, though. <clears throat> but all right, guys. Let me know in the comments if there's anything you want to see. I've got a little list going, so we're trying to get to the... We're going to try to get to those decks, some of those decks you guys commented next week i've already started building a few of them so uh just shoot me some comments though if you want some more decks i will add them to the list all right guys thanks for watching though have a good night